connect black wire to the ground pin of the sensor. Connect red wire to the VCC power pin of the sensor. Connect yellow wire to the SCL I2C clock pin of the sensor. Connect green wire to the SDA data pin for the I2C communication of the sensor. On Arduino Nano, connect the black wire to one of the ground pins. Connect the red wire to 5 volts pin of the Arduino Nano. Connect the green wire to the A4 pin which is also the I2C data pin. Connect the yellow wire to the A5 pin of the Arduino Nano which also is the clock for the I2C communication. Start a new Visuino project. Select board type as Nano. In the component toolbar search box type 6050. Select the accelerometer gyroscope MPU 6000 slash MPU 6050 I2C component from the toolbar and drop it in the design area. Leave some space between the component and the Arduino Nano so we can put components in between. In the search box type angle select acceleration to angle component and drop it in the design area. Click on this out box of the accelerometer gyroscope component and move the mouse over the X pin of the in box of the acceleration to angle 1 component. Click. This will connect the two components together with all X, Y and Z pins. In the search box type packet. Select a packet component and drop it in the design area. Click on the Tools button to open the Elements Editor. Add three binary analog elements. Close the editor. Click on the Out box to start connecting the three pins together. Move the mouse over the IN pin of the first analog element and click. This will automatically connect the three elements. Connect the OUT pin of the packet to the IN pin of the serial channel. Connect the OUT pin of the accelerometer gyroscope component to the IN pin of the I2C channel on the Arduino Nano. The project is ready. Click on this button to generate the Arduino code and open the Arduino IDE. Make sure the proper Arduino board is selected and the proper COM port for the board. Click on this button to compile and upload the code.
the god is applauded. In the serial terminal in Visuino, select the COM port where the device is connected. Select packet 1 as format for the communication. Switch to the scope view and you will see the three channels from our packet communication displayed in the scope. If you switch to the instrument panel, you will see the three instruments there for each channel. Now we can connect and you can see the data arriving from the sensor. If I start rotating the sensor, you will see the angle displayed on the scope and this is the X, Y and Z rotation of the sensor. You can see the angle also in the gauges.